hope so more things are happening it's like the light of god the father in me as the son is not stopping because the easter weekend i have my resurrection and today my i have a lady who works in my house she came in today and she's been she has seen me as god the father she's seen it and um there are other people who have been witness to this in egypt where there's a prophecy that they talk about and i've spent eight years going backwards and forwards and finding my own grave in in egypt where the resurrection of the soul happened and um so today i received so the father is above and in me and then what happens when the father above wants to be fully in me um i get this really light-headed feeling and it's like a magnetic energy and then ancient prayer comes down into me and I then looked at my housekeeper and said you are Matthew you collected taxes and you've always been there for me the same thing happened in hospital where a friend of mine who was the only one who kept vigil by my bed had a memory of her she was rubbing my arms at one point and I said you're rubbing frankincense into my arms you're embalming me and it was like I was dead um, and she sniffed at one point and my eyes were closed because I was in and out of consciousness and I said you cried you, you were there she had the last breath of Christ so I said when I died I gave you my last breath and now you must give it back to me these are the mysteries I'm telling you about right now the things which are not written in the Bible or any of the books because it was too sacred let me tell you if you think Jesus was going to be killed the first time they wanted it the second time so we've been working and it's not just about coming back it's about getting rid of all the evil and I've been working with and removing the energies of all the dark ones and restoring our sacred symbols and our sacred words I am weak at the moment because the operation I had an operation because I had to collect all the sins of the world and these are the energies that have been forced upon the children and then the children then commit sins it's not their fault so I forgave everything and removed all of that but in order to do that and this has taken eight years I've had to carry it somewhere so it's in my human body and then I had to have an operation to remove this cyst which is near my belly button a very tough operation um, open surgery four to eight weeks recovery I've been told I have to tell you all now the truth I have no fear I'm telling you the days are here now they're all here and in my recovery even the light keeps coming in the angels of light keep coming in you all know the truth because now nothing can stop it nothing can stop it because even the air that you breathe is telling you that you know the truth it has information of the truth of your soul of the history of your life the next three months are going to be huge blessings all of you i'm gonna to have to keep updating you now because i've been given the go-ahead to tell you everything